Hi boys and girls, it's Miss Jody. I have a story to read you today. This is one of my favorites. It's called The Big Red Barn by Margaret Wise Brown. By the big red barn in the great green field, there was a pink pig who was learning to squeal. There was a great big horse and a very little horse. And on every barn is a weather vane, of course, a golden flying horse. There was a big pile of hay and a little pile of hay, and that is where the children play. But in this story, the children are away. Only the animals are here today. The sheep and the donkeys, the geese and the goats were making funny noises down in their throats. An old scarecrow was leaning on his hoe and a field mouse was born in a field of corn. Cock-a-doodle-doo! In the barn there was a rooster and a pigeon too. And a big white hen standing on one leg and under the hen was a quiet egg. There was a bantam rooster and a little bantam hen and a big clutch of eggs. Count them, there are 10. Cock-a-doodle-doo, moo, moo. There was a big brown cow and a little brown cow. There was an old black cat Meow, meow, and a tiger tomcat. Meow, meow. There was a big red dog. Bow, wow, and some little puppy dogs all round and warm. And they all lived together in the big red barn. And they played all day in the grass and in the hay. And when the sun went down in the great green field, the big cow lowed and the little pig squealed. The horses stomped in the sweet warm hay, and the little donkey gave one last bray. The hens were sleeping on their nests, even the roosters took a rest. The little bat black bats flew away out of the barn at the end of the day. And there they were all night long, sound asleep, in the big red barn. Only the mice were left to play, rustling and squeaking in the hay, while the moon sailed high in the dark night sky. The end. I miss all you boys and girls. Big hugs to all of you. Bye.